What's up everyone, it's Brian for GumballTech.com and in this video I'm going to show you iRemix. Now what iRemix is, is a small mobile substrate extension that adds a bunch of new features and functionality to the default iPod app. So after you get it installed from Cydia, there's a 5 day trial and then it's $4.99 after that. Uh, to be honest, that is a pretty steep price. So when you first open the iPod app after you get it installed, you should be at the favorites view. Now, it's pretty much like the on-the-go playlist, but it puts everything into a nice view. I mean, you could view the album art and things like that. To add something to the favorites, just browse for something. It could be a album, playlist, artist, or the songs. Then tap and hold. Then go to add to favorites. Then when you go back to the favorites tab, it'll show up. Tapping on one will show you the songs and albums from the artist. Now you can move these around by or deleting them by tapping on edit and then just dragging it around to wherever you want. And then tapping on the X gets rid of it. So that's favorites. Now something else that iRemix does is it adds search the search bar to every view that you're in. So let's say you are browsing albums and you're all the way at the bottom and you want to search for something specific. All you have to do is tap the status bar and then you get a search bar. Then you can search for whatever you'd like. It searches all different types of things such as albums and songs and artists. Just like that. Now I mentioned the on-the-go playlist a little bit earlier, so if you're somebody who uses that, you could still add music to it. So once you find something that you'd like to add, just tap and hold, and then add to on-the-go. And there it is right there. Okay, so say you're listening to a song, and you want to fast forward to a certain part of it. Well, if you hold the fast forward button, you get different interval options. You could uh, skip forward 15 seconds, 30 seconds, 1 minute, or 5 minutes. Now you could also do the same thing when you're uh, rewinding. Just like that. Then after about three seconds, it'll go away. Now, some other cool things that iRemix does is give you the option to look up artist info, album info, music videos, and lyrics. Now, tapping on any of these will background the iPod app and open Safari. Now there's one more thing to show, and that is the, well, this feature here automatically goes to a certain part of the track. So let's say you're listening to a song, and you like what you hear at maybe a minute and 15 seconds. Tapping on this icon here will mark that, and leave it in the memory. And then whenever you tap on this, on the time, it'll instantly rewind back to it. Now you can add multiple uh, times here. And then tapping on the X to the right gets rid of it. So that's pretty much a, an overview of iRemix and what it does. Um, again, it's $5 in the Cydia store, so it's pretty pricey. Um, they do have a five-day trial for it, so I highly recommend giving that a try. Um, if you don't really need these features, like if you just listen to iPod just for music and you don't need lyrics or anything like that, or you know various fast-forward intervals, things like that, uh, this probably won't be for you. 
Um, so save your time and money and put it towards something else. So that was iRemix. Uh, thanks everybody for watching this video and we'll see you soon.